There are thousands of Minecraft mobs, items, and blocks all in the game that are also in real life. Today, we're checking out all of the craziest ones from level one to level 10. Thousand. Grab yourself some popcorn with some good old classic juice. And I'm kind of curious. Let me know down below in the comment section your favorite part of today's video. But without further ado, let's jump right into it. First one up, we have a skeleton. Okay, that's a regular Minecraft skeleton. Oh! Yep, that, that's, a, that's a human skeleton. I, I really hope that's a fake skeleton because that would be terrifying. Oh my goodness. I feel like that's the only image that I've actually seen that is a perfect resemblance of a Minecraft skeleton and a real life skeleton. On the left, we have a Minecraft spider. And on the right, we have a real spider. Ah! Have I told you guys I absolutely hate spiders? They're so creepy and crawly. And hey, is that a spider there? Ah, get it, get it. Okay, it's gone. Thank you. Oh my gosh, please. No more spiders, please. We have a diamond shovel. And on the right is a real shovel. It's not diamond though. That's more like an iron shovel, if anything. Margit! Oh my gosh. It, it's a snowman in Minecraft. And on the right... <laughs> Look at this dude. <laughs> Wait till you see the... <laughs> What the heck is that? That is a snowman in real life. There's a very big difference between the two. It's um, it's rounded. Ah, look at the top of his head. We need a square snowman for this to be literally Margit. 20,000 likes, guys, and I will build a real life Margit. <laughs> literally a real life Margit. On the left, we have a Minecraft dolphin. And on the right, we have a super cute and cuddly real life dolphin. Hey, leave a like on today's video if you love dolphins. They're so cute. I mean, look at the face. Look at the little smile the dolphin has on his face. You want to know what he's saying to you right now? Please subscribe to the channel if you like dolphins. Okay, thank you. Thanks, dolphin. I, I really appreciate that. <laughs> Ooh, we have a diamond in Minecraft and a diamond in real life. Ooh. Who else thought diamonds in real life were going to be more blue like diamonds in Minecraft? I mean, I can't be the only person that thought that. That's still very beautiful, though. That is a very, very nice crystal, I must say. We have a Minecraft turtle versus a real life turtle. Oh, look at how cute he is. Oh, my goodness. Dude, I freaking love sea turtles. Every time I see sea turtles, I, I always think of finding Nemo. <laughs> look at how cute he is. He's looking at the camera. He's just like. Hi, I see you. If I wasn't if I wasn't named Shark, I would totally be Turtle Man. What do you think? Do you like it? <laughs> we got Alex in Minecraft, and on the right, we have Alex in real life. Oh my gosh, dude, the resemblance is actually crazy. She's got the blue shirt. I mean, Alex's shirt is kind of green, but the orange hair matches perfectly along with the iron sword and the little strap around her waist. I mean, that is perfect. That's literally exactly Alex in real life. This would be the coolest Halloween costume, just saying. Now we got a chest in Minecraft and a chest in real life. Yo, that chest looks so cool. Oh my gosh, I want one. Minecraft axe versus a real life axe. Whoa, that's also very cool. You see, this would have been 10 times cooler if the real life axe was blue like a diamond. At least just spray painted blue. If it's not a real diamond axe, just spray painted to make it look like one. But that is still super cool, dude. Holy cow. Ooh, we have a bat in Minecraft and a bat in real life. <laughs> the bat in real life is so cute. I mean, look at him. He's just looking at the camera. Listen closely. I think I, think I can hear what he's saying. We have beans. We have gold in Minecraft and gold in real life. Oh my goodness. That gold in real life looks so shiny and beautiful. Look at that. I just I just want to grab it and eat it. No, you can't eat gold. Obviously, you would probably break all your teeth. No, 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 I don't want to eat it. That is so shiny and beautiful. Oh my gosh. We have an ender dragon in Minecraft and an ender dragon in real life. Yo, wait, what are the odds that this picture is actually real? And little do we all know, there's secretly dragons flying around the world when we go to sleep at nighttime. We would never know. They could just fly over our houses and we would literally never know that. Before you go to sleep tonight, I want you guys to look up in the stars for maybe five minutes. Let me know if you spot a dragon i will do the same because i'm determined that there are dragons somewhere on earth minecraft sheep versus a real life sheep <laughs> dude they're so cute i freaking love sheep they're so cute we got a minecraft torch versus a real life torch okay the resemblance here that's that's really good but i have to say it looks like a tree that fell over and they just burnt the top because <laughs> that's a big torch we got a silverfish in Minecraft and a silverfish in real life. Wait, there's no way. There's no there's no silverfish in real life, is there? I no, no. There's there's no way. Silver fish in real life. There's no freaking way it's real. <gasps> what? Silverfish 
No way. Look at these guys. Bro, look at these things. They're so gross. Oh my gosh. Wait, wait. Do the silverfish in real life actually come out of blocks? Like, is that a real thing? You're building a house and all of a sudden, poof, there's silverfish everywhere. Oh, oh God, I got, I got the heebie-jeebies. Thank goodness VFX is a real thing because I would scream. This is a fox in Minecraft and a fox in real life. Oh! Hug him. He's so cute. A Minecraft ghast versus a real life ghast. <laughs> it's a gas pinata, guys. Oh my gosh. Hey, just saying, my birthday's on this Sunday. So, what if my pinata was this ghast? That would be super cool. I wonder, though, there's got to be a better looking ghast. We got a Minecraft panda versus a real life panda. Dude, pandas are so cute. I absolutely love pandas. They're so adorable. We got a Minecraft squid versus a real life squid. I got to say, I got to hand it to him, okay? Minecraft squids look cuter, I think. Real life squids, it just looks like a giant brain. Look, I'm no squid expert, okay? But to me, it just looks like a big brain, like a big Einstein uh, brain. We got a diamond sword versus a real life diamond sword. Oh my gosh, that sword looks so cool. Look at that thing. Again, I feel like I would consider that more to be an iron sword because it looks like iron more than diamond. But I, if that's actually made out of diamond, that must be one very powerful sword. If I had that real life sword, I would cut every single cake that I got with the sword. I'd just be like, ah, cake cut. <laughs> We got a Minecraft pig versus a real life pig. Oh, dude, the real life pig is so adorable. He's so furry. Look at him. He's just so cute. Oh my gosh. Polar bear in Minecraft versus polar bear in real life. Hello, polar bear up in the Arctic Canadian cold weather. How you doing? He's so cute. We got an Enderman in Minecraft versus an Enderman in real life. Hey, the Enderman in real life, he stole my grass block. What are you doing with that grass block? Look at the eyes. They actually light up just like the Enderman too. That is actually so cool. Oh my gosh. These Halloween costumes are on par. These are so freaking cool. We got an ocelot in Minecraft and an ocelot in real life. Now, I gotta say that ocelot in real life looks like a kitten that I don't think you would want to play with. That kitten looks uh, very wild and would probably eat our faces off. So if you ever see an ocelot in real life, be careful. <laughs> Oh, I kind of admire the ocelots in Minecraft a lot more. They look so cute. Leave a like if you agree with me. Next up, we got a chicken in Minecraft versus a chicken in real life. Oh, back, 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 back. Oh my gosh, they're so cute. We got a magma cube in Minecraft versus a magma cube in... A magma cube in real life? What is that? I don't even see an animal there. I just see molten lava just flowing down rocks. Are there secretly magma cubes inside of lava and we've never known it this whole time? What if the creators of Minecraft know something that we don't know? What if the creators of Minecraft know that there are magma cubes in real life and we just never knew it? So many unsolved mysteries. We got a cow in Minecraft and a cow in real life. Oh, look at him. He's just eating some grass with his family. Going through the field like a happy cow he is. So cute. We got Philippe the parrot in Minecraft and Philippe the parrot in real life. I want you guys to let me know if you guys have if you've ever seen a parrot like this in real life. I've seen them maybe once or twice and I gotta say they're one of the coolest birds I've ever seen before. They're so beautiful and all their colors are just insane. Next up, we got a golden apple in Minecraft and a golden apple in real life. Ooh, will I get extra hearts if I eat a golden apple in real life? Is that is that a thing? Will that actually happen? Because if so, I'm down. Yo, that's so cool, though. I would love to eat a golden apple. We got a Minecraft grass block versus a real life grass block. Yo, okay, that's cool. We got a kitten in Minecraft versus a kitten in real life. Aw, they're playing in the snow. The kid, I didn't know cats like snow. That's so adorable. We got a llama in Minecraft and a llama in real life. <laughs> Dude, he, the real life one looks so derpy. <laughs> we got a drowned in Minecraft versus a drowned in real life. Oh, that's terrifying. That's terrifying. That's very terrifying. We got a bunny in Minecraft and a bunny in real life. Oh, dude, I freaking love bunnies so much. If you guys didn't know, I have a bunny. His name's Drake. He's super fluffy and cute, and he is just so adorable. I love bunnies. We got TNT in Minecraft versus TNT in real life. Yeah, you know, I kind of wish TNT in real life was like cubes like TNT, like in Minecraft. That'd be cool. We got a Minecraft villager versus a real life villager. Again, Halloween costumes. Beautiful. 10 out of 10. Amazing. And the real life villagers even holding an emerald. Look at that. 
I wonder what that villager trade offers. Hmm. Maybe one emerald for a pizza? We got a diamond hoe in Minecraft versus a diamond hoe in real life. Now, I gotta say, the diamond hoe in real life, it's more like an iron hoe. Look at it. It's, it's silver. Probably made out of steel or maybe even iron, but like, just spray paint them blue. Just spray paint them blue to look so much more real. We got a pigment in Minecraft versus a pigment in real life. Dude, that's so awesome. Oh my gosh, I love that. That's so cool. We got a slime in Minecraft and a slime in real life. Yo, that's so cool. Look at it. It looks just like jello. I kind of want to... Oh man, I want jello now. We got a Minecraft horse versus a real life horse. Look at that. Nay. Or er, 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 whatever horse is saying. What a horse is saying. Nay. Nay. Oh, no, no. We got Steve in Minecraft and Steve in real life. <laughs> That jawline, though, dude, look at that jawline. That's a hey, jawline on fleek. We got a puffer fish in Minecraft and a puffer fish in real life, dude. The, 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 he's so cute. He's so cute. He's so cute. I love puffer fish. Who could ever look at this thing and say that it's not adorable? I mean, that puffer fish is the cutest thing I think I've ever seen before. Oh my gosh, I love it. We got a witch in Minecraft versus a witch in real life. It's just a regular costume. It's not really a Minecraft witch, right? We got an iron golem in Minecraft and an iron golem in real life. One word interesting i'm just saying if i saw that real life golem walking down the street i would probably turn the other way and run for my life it's slightly terrifying we got a minecraft zombie versus a real life zombie oh my goodness please never ever have a zombie outbreak that would be terrifying oh another zombie okay that one's a lot better that one literally looks like a minecraft zombie that one is sick i love that one we got a minecraft creeper versus a real life creeper <laughs> it's a baby what the heck Wait, is it... Did they put the creeper outfit on a baby? Because when babies poop, it usually goes everywhere and it, like, blows up? Or was that just me as a kid? Was I... Tell me I wasn't the only kid that had explosive diarrhea. I can't be the only kid that had that. We got another creeper versus a real life. What? Uh, real life creeper? Uh, you know what they say. <laughs> Turn that frown upside down. Uh, uh, Iron Golem? <laughs> Yo, what the? Yo, he's got... Oh, my hairy back. I mean, dude, whoa. I gotta say, though, I like those jeans. Santa, what? It's a, It's too early in the season. What are you doing, man? I didn't know Santa goes for a tan. Aw, cat. Whoa, 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 whoa. Why is there a knife with the cat? Take, take the knife away. The poor little kitten's about to cry. Look at the tears in its eyes. We can't do that to our kittens, guys. Love our kittens. Oh my gosh, dude. I'm sorry, meow, meow. I would totally take you. I'm sorry. Meow, meow. Oh, it's a wither skeleton. It's a wither skeleton. What could it be? What could it be? Ah! It's, a, it's, a, it's a skeleton running with... Is that a machete in its hand? I can't, I can't really tell. I, we're going to call it a machete. Okay, we have an Enderman. Whoa! 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 Mark it! Mark it! <laughs> Yo, that is the most messed up looking market I think I've ever seen in my entire life. What is that thing? That is terrifying. It's leaning. Okay, my question is, how did you build that snowman? Like, it's almost, it's legitimately taller than their house. Did you, like, get up on the roof and keep, like, packing it or something? Like, I, I that, they must be Canadian. Aghast. Oh, no, that is creepy. Oh, God. Almost reminds me of the lunar moon. Oh. oh, this is just pure, pure, pure confusion at this point. Oh, I hate those mobs, dude. Oh, oh. get out. Oh, it's a wither. Yo, it's a flying man. It's a flying man with lightning. Whoa. Oh, dolphin! Da, 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 da. Oh, why, why is why is she crying? It's just a dolphin. They're so freaking cute. Listen, guys, dolphins are so adorable. I love dolphins, and although I'm a part of the shark family, sharks are pretty terrified of dolphins. I have to say. Oh, a traitor! Oh God, that's I legitimately just got goosebumps all over my arms. That is creepy. That is so creepy. Oh, it's a blaze. 
The blaze, okay. <laughs> oh my gosh, dude. RIP his face. Creeper. I can't even see the creeper. Ooh. Oh, it's a witch. What the? What? It's a dude with a banjo in his hand? And why are there cops out? Okay. Oh, it's a bee. Oh! Ah! Oh! Preserve the eye! Oh, God! Oh, God! The stinger! It's right. Oh, God! Okay, next. Next. Go away. Go away, please. No, I don't want to look at that ever again. Oh, it's a little butt. A panda! What the panda alligator is that? No way that's a real thing. No way that's a real thing. Ah, uh, that's weird. That's actually creepy. That's really creepy. Oh, a cow. No. No. Wait, is there a cow in the backseat of that car? There is. What the? How could you fit a poor, a poor pig cow? I can't even speak. But you know what I mean. <laughs> oh, my gosh. What the heck? That's so bad. Slime. Some... I Hey, hello. You you forgot your you forgot your belly on the table again. Yeah, yeah. Just yeah, you want to come pick it up? Yeah. Uh, okay. Yeah, I'll I'll hold on to it for like twenty minutes for you. You're gonna come grab it though, right? A horse? What? Donkeys carries mini guns? Two plus two is twenty. What? Spider? Oh, that's terrifying. Okay. I think I'm about to have nightmares. <laughs> oh my gosh, I love that. I love that. It's gonna be my Halloween costume. What the? Okay, that's just creepy. <laughs> what? Is that Andy from Toy Story? What? I never thought a villager was gonna be Andy from Toy Story. Okay, that's a parrot. Silverfish? Oh, that's a beetle, though. What the? Skeleton? <laughs> He's shooting a shovel. What the heck? A piggy. Oink. Oh, what? There's a pig out the tail light of the car. What? Dude, first people transport cows in the backseat of their car. Now they're transporting piggies in the backseat of your car. If I was driving down the road like this and I looked over to my right and I saw a piggy in the tail light of another car, I would probably pull over and I'd want to take him home. He looks so cute. Polar bear. Oh my gosh. Yeah, just casual day, you know, just hopping on the bus and polar bear. Polar Express walks off the bus. Yeah, just casual day in in Canada or the Arctic. Oh god, dude, that zombie's creepy. Oh, Tuttle. Why does he have a knife? No, Tuttle, no knife. Oh, oh, oh god, no, no, no. Never, never again, never again. Whoa, what no, no, that was just, no, that, that was way too much for me. Alright, guys, listen, listen, okay. I know what you guys are already thinking. Alright, Shark, you're gonna start out with the basic blocks and well, no, we're not gonna do grass, we're not gonna do logs. We all know that's in real life, okay? But I wanna start off with a bees nest, okay? A bees nest right here in the game. It is a cube covered in honey, and it actually I don't know, I don't know about you guys, but that looks like a very good block. Like if I were to smell this block and I didn't know it was a beehive or there was honey inside of it i for some reason for some reason i would think it would smell like cinnamon don't ask but that's just that's just what i would think <laughs> let's see if a beehive in real life looks something like this okay yeah so obviously if you guys have seen a beehive before obviously they don't look exactly like the ones in minecraft dude that's a massive swarm of bees but i'm trying to see what an actual beehive would look like up close hey look mm, honey i mean i guess you could say a beehive in minecraft kind of looks like the one in game but that is an artificial beehive that somebody that's one that somebody made in order to actually into actually making honey and having bees all in one little area but a beehive wow that, that's a beehive dude that's terrifying dude that's even more oh my gosh okay yeah remind me to stay away from beehives so the next thing that we have to review with minecraft that's also in real life we're gonna check a sheep but no no ordinary sheep i want to see all the different color sheeps that are in real life is there such thing as a red sheep is there such things as a purple sheep or is there such things as a rainbow sheep let's find out rainbow sheep oh my god <laughs> 
<laughs> Dude, that's so cool. <laughs> oh my gosh, there's no way that's actually real, bro. That's a, they're not born like that. That's for sure. They, somebody must have put coloring dye in in their fur. If that's Hopefully that's even healthy. But dude, look at this one. That one kind of looks legit. But dude, the power of Photoshop nowadays, we never know. Dude, rainbow sheeps would be so cool. How about a red sheep? That's gotta be a thing, right? No way! The red sheep of Scotland. Hey, if any people from Scotland are watching right now, please, please, please confirm. Are red sheeps a real thing? Please, 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 please. That would be so cool if that was a thing. All right, guys, so the next mob that we have to check out, of course, we have the zombie, ladies and gentlemen. Honestly, guys, as a kid, I always thought a zombie outbreak would be one of the scariest things I would ever have to go through in life, but I think I'm actually mistaken. If a zombie outbreak happened, that would only be the icing on the cake as to how 2020 has gone so far. But let's go ahead and see just exactly uh, what a zombie would look like in real life. Yeet. Wow, I, that zombie literally just got saved. Zombie. Let's see what comes up. Oh my gosh. Yeah, it's all... Dude, this is so crazy. Halloween just kind of passed, and now I'm, I'm all I'm thinking is about is Halloween again. So obviously, the zombies that you would expect to see in real life don't exactly look like the zombies in Minecraft. Minecraft zombies are like just a couple few colors, and they're very squared off. But boy, tell me, if zombies in real life look like zombies in Minecraft, they would be way less intimidating, because imagine this thing. Imagine this thing breaking down your front door trying to eat your brain. Like, bro, come on, come on. That, 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 that thing? Oh my, count me on the first ticket to Jupiter. I am out of here, dude. Now, guys, we just checked out a zombie. Of course, we also have to take a look at a skeleton. Are there such things of skeletons that hold bow and arrows? Let's find out. Skeleton holding a bow and arrow in real life. Wow, that's a very specific search term. I mean, here's a dude showing you how to make a bow and arrow, but that's not exactly what we're looking for. And then, of course, there's a Minecraft skeleton. <laughs> Whoa, this is a cool image. Archery. Oh, man, of course. I mean, I didn't really expect there to be any photos of a real life skeleton, but like, I mean, that's kind of, that's not even real life. That's more, that's more pixely than Minecraft, dude. Dang it. Can somebody recreate a real skeleton with a bow and arrow in real life? That's all we need, okay? I mean, this guy's halfway there. He just has to be a skeleton and not a, a living human. You know what I mean, right? Next mob in the list here, guys. We have the one and only a beautiful, beautiful, loving, caring, galloping horse. Dude, I love horses so much. I saw a horse when I was a little kid. They're so big. They're so cool. Like, ah! I love horses, dude. I want to ride off in the sunset eating lava cakes with a horse. That is my ideal date. But dudes, check this out. This horse is... We all know horses in Minecraft are so cool, but let's check out exactly what a horse would look like in real life for those that haven't seen one. Horse. Let's see. Dude, I love horses so much. Look, we got mama horse right here. And we got baby horse right there. They're just chilling, having a great time, dude. Oh my gosh. How much does it cost to buy a horse? Well, you don't got to tell me twice. Dude, look how pretty that thing is. Oh my gosh. Imagine one of... The, dude, you know, dogs and cats are cool. But imagine a horse. Imagine a horse. You could be like... Billy, hey Billy, come over here. Oh, you see that? There, here comes Billy. Hey Billy, Billy, come on here, Billy. All right, guys. So the next item on our list here happens to be weeping vines. Now this is a now this is a more recent update to the game, as it just as the update just came out not too long ago, and it's when they introduced weeping vines. Now I don't know if it's a real thing in real life. I don't think vines can cry, and I feel like weeping means crying. But I mean, I mean, either way, let's search into Google to see what exactly it thinks this might be. Weeping vines. Let's see. Okay, of course, Minecraft pops up. Real life. That's a very big keyword that you have to write in there because real life is gonna is gonna tell Google that hey, we don't care about Minecraft. We want to know real life. Vine tapestry. So is that what a is that what a is that what a weeping vine would be? But it's not red, so it doesn't exactly look like that. Weeping vine. Okay, so it's like a decal almost. It's not red like Minecraft. Something tells me I, there's no such thing as a weeping vine in real life. If any of you guys are experts and happen to know if a weeping vine is real, be sure to let me know down below in the comments. All right, so we've got another one here that I'm also a little bit skeptical about. And uh, well, that happens to be crying obsidian. This, as well as weeping vines, just came out in one of the most recent updates. And why is it called crying obsidian? I just, no, why is it crying? It's not even crying. There's no tears. I, I'm just, I, I'm so confused. I have so many questions that need so many answers and I'm not getting them. Crying Obsidian. Let's see what pops up. Oh my, of course, it's Minecraft. Crying Obsidian, real life. That's the key word that we have to write, okay? Whoa, no way. In my house, I found this mineral that kind of looks like Crying Obsidian. Yo, that is sick. Dude, I am such a huge fan of rocks like these. Like, I would love to start, I would love to start collecting crystals and rocks just like this one because that looks so cool. Dude, it looks just like Crying Obsidian. It's got the same purple vibrant. Hello? 
Yes, this is Obsidian. Jeb, Ditterbone, Notch, and many other devs will most likely pass away in your lifetime. Crying Obsidian. That's so sad. No. All right, guys, I'm sorry to be that guy, but there is one more item on the list here, and this one is a little bit less interesting, but it's one I've been meaning to check out, which that happens to be help. <laughs> help in real life. Let's see. Oh, my. Wow, that's beautiful. Wow. That is so cool. I love being a shark. Dude, this is so cool. Oh, my gosh. Look, it's a shark swimming through kelp. Guys, is that even kelp? Kelp. I, I need to make sure. Kelp. Kelp. Oh, kelp. <laughs> Dude, that's so cool. Okay, obviously, the kelp in Minecraft kind of looks like the kelp in real life, but it really... It looks like kelp in real life when kelp in real life is underwater because when it's taken above water, it looks different. Maybe that one's chopped up because it's like a salad or something, but... <laughs> All right, let's see. Sponge. <laughs> This is exactly what I expected to pop up. This is a cleaning sponge. Okay, guys, this is a cleaning sponge. We all probably have them in our kitchen or maybe something like this. This is a lot more common too. In fact, I got one downstairs. But here's the thing. Sponges in real life do not work the same way as sponges in Minecraft. Because if they did, I wouldn't have to clean up as many darn dishes as I do. Ah! Just imagine how convenient it would be if you could in real life go down and just throw a sponge on top of your dishes and... Voila, they're instantly clean. Please, somebody invent that. Yeah, you know what? I think I think we all wish that's actually how sponges worked because that would probably save everybody a whole heck of time. Second item on the list we have today, ladies and gents, we have the emerald block. It's so very similar to the diamond block. If you are lucky enough to collect as many emeralds to craft a block out of it, you can get yourself one of these emerald blocks. Now, emerald blocks are certainly beautiful, especially with this resource pack. I mean, th this looks so crisp. Are emerald blocks as they are in Minecraft in real life? I personally, I've never seen one, but let's turn to our best friend Google and see what they say. Emerald block. Let's see. So if I search up emerald block, all Minecraft. Now let's do in real life. Let's see what do we get? Whoa, that is sick. If that's actually, okay, I don't think that's, act, wait, is it? I was gonna say, I don't think that's what Emerald looks like, but there's so many articles about the same photo. 1.1 kilogram and 5,655 carat Emerald unearthed in Zambia. Okay, if that is real, that is sick. I want one, whatever it is. Take take all my money, take it. I, I, don't, I don't, I want that. That looks so cool, dude. It's like a little, it's like a nightlight. Imagine a nightlight like that. Okay, that, sorry. I know we're going off topic. Okay, I'm sorry. My, my inner kid is just coming out. Next one up on the list here, ladies and gents, is a little bit different from just an item. We're going Armin. Yes, we're over at the villager farms here. and We have wheat, ladies and gentlemen. This is how you can make bread. Now, is the process similar in real life? Nah, I don't know. I'm not exactly the best agricultural farmer person. I'm really only good at Minecraft. But let's find out. Wheat in real life. Let's see. Oh, wow. Yeah, this, this is literally a Minecraft inventory of a guy holding wheat. Look, you can literally see wheat in his inventory. Wheat farm. Let's see what a wheat farm looks like. Oh, <laughs> yes, this is what it is, ladies and gents. Okay, so yeah, this is this is probably more similar to what a wheat farm would be like. But, but the only thing that's throwing me off here is this isn't there supposed to be water somewhere around there, like in in the middle of the wheat, so then the crops can grow and you can make bread. Is that not is that not how it works? I don't see any water nearby. That seems awfully dry. I, I mean, I could be wrong, but it's just, I don't see any water. All right. We're gonna say yes, the process is very similar, but um, if anybody is a farmer, please let me know in the comments. How do, how does this work? Where's the water? Is it underground? Do you, do you water it yourself? How, how does this work? The rain? What? Next blocks on the list here, guys. We're going underwater. These are the coral blocks. We have bubble coral, we have tube coral, horn coral, and fire coral blocks. Now, obviously, an ocean requires coral for fish and other ecosystems to live in and survive and feed from. Now. Are these accurate names for all the coral that we happen to have in real life? Let's find out. Fire coral. Let's see. Oh, wow. Whoa. This is a fire coral. This is a venomous coral. What? All right. So apparently the fire coral is actually a type of coral that is venomous to, to anything that is not immune to it or supposed to be around it. That is cool. How about horn coral? Now, a bunch of fossils have come up here. Horn coral, 350 million years old. 
So if horn coral is still a thing, then this hap this got this has to be some kind of rare coral or something. Elk horn coral on Colombian shallows. That is so pretty, dude. We also have tube coral. Let's see. <gasps> Yo, they look like little pockies. <laughs> These are so cool. Do the fish just go inside of them or how does that work? They just like, oh yeah, I'm gonna rent this little coral hole in here and live in it. That is actually so sick. I would love to go scuba diving and actually find coral like this. This is so interesting just to even look at. Wow, dude, that is so sick. Next block on the list, ladies and gents, happens to be soul sand. We all know soul sand, okay? You go collect in the nether, it slows you down when you walk on top of it. You could use it for many things, such as an elevator or traps, or even just decoration around your build. Now, is soul sand a real thing in real life? I, I don't know, but bedrock, grass, sand, dirt, gravel, all that other stuff is. Let's see if soul sand is a real thing soul sand let's see oh no this this is this is in minecraft obviously real life um hmm. let's see this is creepy this is actually very very creepy i'm not seeing any photos of real life sand soul sand soul sand material what i don't even know what that is that is creepy yo okay yeah let's let's just click off this before i have nightmares Next one on the list here, ladies and gents, we have the end portal. Now, of course, we all also know what the end portal is. If you go ahead and collect a bunch of eyes of Ender, you can ignite this portal and head to the final dimension of Minecraft, the end. Ah! Oh, oh. Huh? It, it might, it, I, no, I gotta be doing something wrong. Come on, I got it this time. I got it. What? Ah, yes. This, ladies and gents, is the end portal, okay? Now, the end portal, obviously, if this was a real life thing, there would be a possibility to go between inner dimensions and teleport places. But let's just see what our imagination can pull off when we search it up on Google. End portal in real life. Let's see. We've seen the nether portals before in real life, but an end portal? That one's a little bit too much. End portal in real life. I'm emphasizing real. Oh man, I got really excited for a, a possibility portal. It's just a guy chilling by a door. Man, I got really excited thinking that we could find a real life ender portal, dude. That, come on, that would be so cool. Ladies and gentlemen, this is essentially Minecraft, but in real life, I think the final element that we have yet to go over would happen to be water now if we have gone through water in one of the previous episodes uh, i wanted to touch on it again because with this specific shader pack th this gives off way more of a water effect that real life would give off not only can you see it almost straight to the bottom but it also has like the wavy nice little wave effects to it that water does genuinely have the real life shader pack that we're using seriously steps the game up in how crystal clear that water actually looks and especially when you go underwater too Tell me this doesn't look realistic. You have the sun rays shining. You have sun rays shining through the water when you go underwater. You can see little water particles. It just gives you this bluish little effect as if you're actually underwater. I mean, this is as close as it's going to actually get. Now let's see what an under now let's see what an underwater photo in real life would look like underwater photo okay let's see um this is a perfect example of an underwater shot like we were saying you can see the sun rays clearly and perfectly in this you can also see all the fish the nice little blue effect that it gives you when you go underwater i wonder what this would look like in real life dude this is so cool grindstone ancient high resolution oh it's a stock photo <laughs> Okay, grindstone in Minecraft and grindstone in real life verified. It's legit. All right, the next block I needed to check out only because I thought it looked super cool is one of the newer blocks that has been introduced in the recent updates of Minecraft, and that happens to be a warped high fey. Warped high fey. I, I think that's how you say it. Now you guys know you find this block in the Nether, and this block looks really cool. I'm actually a huge fan of all the textures, and I really like how some of the blocks and the colors change on them. Warped high fey real life let's see okay so of course we have a lot of screenshots of it in minecraft not seeing anything in real life is warped hyphy real let's just go to google search and of course the first thing that comes up is minecraft dudes minecraft is taking over everybody you guys have to let me know down below in the comments is this an actual real block because literally google can't even find it now, similar to the previous block we did, I wanted to check out another really cool and satisfying looking block, which happens to be the glided black stone. Now, this stone, as you guys know, also is found in the nether. It's got this really cool black and gold texture on it. Ooh, is 
so pretty. Honestly, this is so cool. I love the new blocks they introduced in the game because they're such cool decorative tools. I mean, the stuff you can build with these new blocks is actually insane. If you guys really like the new blocks that they added in the recent updates, be sure to leave a like on today's video. Glided Blackstone real life. Let's see. Glided, glided. I don't know. I'm sorry, guys. I, I, I really did not do well in English class. <laughs> Okay, so yeah, of course, we're having a ton. <laughs> Wait, is this a meme? Guys, is it meme time? Glitted Blackstone is the first block in vanilla Minecraft to have a random chance at dropping a different item. Gravel. <laughs> I'm sorry. I'm sorry. This isn't a meme. This isn't a meme review. Okay, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. <laughs> we just we had to pull one. Okay, we had to pull one. If this is a real type of stone that you could find in real life, I'm going mining tomorrow. Give me my pickaxe. Give me my sword. I'm going to the mountains and I'll catch you guys in a year when I get some. Okay, maybe I'm just kidding, but, you know, maybe if this video got 100,000 likes, I'll actually go mining for it. Just saying. Next mob we have here, ladies and gentlemen, is the Axolotti. Now, I'm probably saying that wrong. Yes, I understand, but they are the cutest little baby little sea creatures, and they love to swim, and they got cute little eyes and cute little tails and little fins. They're pretty much like the baby... They're pretty much like the baby shark, but no, not the not the baby shark song. Please don't play it again. They're like literally a little baby sea creature. They're so adorable. I absolutely love them. How could you ever hate something like this? And they eat squid and other fish. That's so adorable. Axolotti real life. Let's... Oh! Oh my gosh. Guys, they're, they're, they're real. You're telling me these things are real? I want one! Okay, I am not kidding when I say this. This is probably one of the cutest little things I've ever seen in my entire life. And I'm also not kidding when I say this. If this video breaks, if this video actually breaks like 50,000, I'll, I'll do it for 50,000. I will get a real life axolotl. And I will name it after whatever you guys choose. Okay, so I, I'm serious. Serious. No, no. Like, I'm legitimately not kidding. I will actually get one and you guys can name it whatever you want. Oh, wow. That's a lot of dead fish. Okay. Okay, you know what? Maybe we have to reconsider. Next up, ladies and gentlemen, happens to be another block in the game that is, well, it's not new, new, but it's kind of new if we're comparing from like 1.8 Minecraft to now, but it's it, it's on the newer list. This is the scaffold. Now the scaffold have now the scaffold happens to be one of my favorite blocks because of how just how convenient it actually is. I mean, you can build some of the largest towers just by using a scaffold. And you guys may also know a lot of people can also buy scaffolds in real life. I mean, Unspeakable has one in his backyard. These things are really cool. Well, they're mainly used for construction and getting to higher heights and uh, to travel and, and build things. Yeah, yeah. let's see what one looks like in real life. Scaffold real life. Oh my God. Oh wow, yeah, that's a, that's, that's, that's a scaffold all right. That, that's, oh my gosh, dude, that is scaffolding to a next level. You know something, guys, something that's, I just, I've always had this one question growing up as a kid. And if anybody may know that answer to this, please let me know down below in the comments. Every time you see new construction somewhere, I feel like scaff... Okay, ready? Hear me, hear me out for this. Okay, hear me out. Okay, every time that you see any construction, maybe they're building a... Maybe they're building a new mall or they're building a house or they're building a, an apartment building. I feel like these big giant scaffolds, you know, something, something like this, scaffolds and cranes pop up out of nowhere. Like, where do they go? They just... Does somebody put them piece by piece together like a Lego set? And then when they're done using them, do you take them apart? The next one I'm so glad they added to the game, guys, happens to be powdered snow buckets. <laughs> yes, you guys heard me. Literally a bucket of snow just like this. And this also ties in with the snow block because, of course, you can't have a snow block without a bucket of snow. That's just not how this works. If you guys are new to the channel and you haven't seen me before, I am Canadian. What does that mean? Well, that means I live, breathe, and eat snow all day, 24-7. I literally, I'm living in an igloo as we speak. I'm recording this video inside of an igloo. Yes, 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 I know. I, it's what true Canadians do, okay? But the fact they added powdered snow into Minecraft makes me so happy because it just adds that little bit of, it just adds that little bit of cold snow Canadian vibes and oh, I just love snow. I wonder what powdered snow would look like in real life. Powdered snow. Oh, yep. It's exactly what I thought it would be. It's literally artificial snow like this one. So what's really cool is you can actually get artificial snow. You can buy them off Amazon. And all you have to do is add water to it. And it becomes super fluffy, just like just like the bucket in Minecraft. Literally just like this. But you don't necessarily sink in it like you do in Minecraft. But you can get fake snow. So if you live somewhere where it's usually very hot climates, maybe in California, Arizona, Las Vegas, somewhere over there. If you ever wanted to experience snow, just go ahead and go ahead and 
and order a pack off Amazon and just add some water and voila, you can officially say that you've experienced a little bit of snow. All right, ladies and gentlemen, next up we have, we have a mob in Minecraft that is, that's been around for quite some time now. Now, when you, when you encounter this mob, it's never usually a good thing and the battle seems to always be difficult. That happens to be the Ravager. Oh my gosh. Yeah, we all know the Ravagers, okay? These things are absolutely insane. They look scary. They kind of remind me of giant elephants. What would a Ravager look like in real life? And well, let's just hope that they're not actually real. Ravager in real life. Oh, wow. People made a lot of drawings about a Ravager. Look at this. I drew a Ravager. Yo, that would be terrifying if that was in real life. Ravager in real life. Is there anything about that? No way. So is Ravager only a thing that is in Minecraft? I mean, I would understand why, but it feels like I totally thought they would maybe reference a rhino in Minecraft or something. Oh, wow. Okay. Yep. And he destroys stuff like a rhino too. Let me know what you guys think down below in the comments. And let me know which mobs, let me know which mobs, items, and blocks I should be reviewing in the next video, ladies and gentlemen. Thank you guys all so much for watching. And I'll catch you guys. I'll catch you guys later today in a second video. Peace out myself so i need i need to disguise as something noobish perfect my new username is a s k l d j h s k j d h j f Mwah. i love it okay now i need to turn my disguise minecraft but in real life all right welcome back to a brand new video ladies and gents this is minecraft but in real life in this series we compile the latest and greatest items mobs and blocks that are in minecraft and compare them to real life things or things that are close to being in real life this is episode number 400,372 and 21 3 it's it's it, it, yeah okay, you get it okay it's it's been a lot of episodes okay we're running out of things to showcase this may or may not be one of the last episodes of Minecraft but in real life so if you're gonna miss this series I'm gonna need you to go ahead and drop a like on today's video okay deal okay perfect deal first block on our list here is bedrock boom okay we all know bedrock right Wait, this is the strongest block in Minecraft in fact you can't break it you can't break it no matter how hard you try how many mods you try you cannot break bedrock I mean unless you're Unless you're in creative mode. This is bedrock in real life. Yes. I feel like in one of the other episodes, we may have done bedrock or we did upset. I'm not sure. Now, if you want to know what bedrock actually looks like, here's a video on my vlogging channel, Life of Shark, where I tested a bunch of different items with bedrock spray. Look, if you guys are not subscribed to my vlogging channel right now, I need every single person watching this video to go to my vlog channel and subscribe. I'm telling you, there are some insane videos on there. We all know what bedrock looks like, okay? Let's be honest. It's, it's bedrock. Let's try and find some something that's a little bit uh, more interesting for the final episode of Minecraft in real life. Ladies and gents, next on the list, we have glowstone. We all love glowstone. They're very similar to sea lanterns as well. They are both blocks that illuminate a very bright light. You place this in a dark room or a dark area, you don't even need to worry about torches anymore. These will last you forever and produce way more light than any torch will. Thank you for always being loyal to me, glowstone. Glowstone in real life. What does it look like exactly? Um, whoa, real life glowstone? Wait, is that a real thing? Dude, that is so cool. Look, the whole rock right here and the guy is like holding it. What? Okay, that, that, that's not the same, is it? That's not the same. I don't, I don't, I don't think so, but that would be sick. Dude, that is so cool looking. Whatever that is, that looks so sick. It, it would be real life glowstone. Dude, they made a Minecraft redstone lamp. That is so sick. Hey, 20,000 likes on this video, and I will make a redstone lamp and put it beside my bed. Next up on the list, ladies and gents, we have a ladder. All right, so I'm pretty certain that everybody watching this video has probably seen a ladder before. Okay, let's be honest. But in Minecraft, ladders are a little bit different. Ladders in Minecraft are essentially this block that attach to other blocks and allow you to climb straight up. And now ladders could work like that theoretically in real life, but not all ladders do. Let's check it out. Ladders, here we go. Now, this is a proper ladder, if you ask me. They're on two stands just like this, and, well, you can climb up to your roof if you want to. Now, this is a real ladder. Now, ladder on side of building. This is probably more like Minecraft ladders, okay? Yeah, see, this would be more like a Minecraft ladder. The only difference is this is made out of metal or steel, whereas in Minecraft, it looks like it's made out of wood. More, more like this, actually. This would be pretty darn close to it. Maybe. <gasps> Wait a second. What if ladders in Minecraft are just rusty steel real life ladders? Oh my gosh, we have figured it out. I bet you did not expect this one, ladies and gents. Next, we have the sun in Minecraft. 
The sun is pretty much a giant sea lantern block. It looks just like a giant sea lantern block. I mean, you can't see any details in the sun. You can't see any closer to it. You can try and fly as far as you want to get to the sun, but no matter how hard you try, you will not be able to get there. Now, what does the sun look like up close and personal in real life? Let's find out. This is the sun. Holy cow. So many of you may already know this. Okay, everybody's taking their science classes here, but the sun is a massive ball of energy and fire and explosions and craziness that provides all the heat and light for us on earth look at dude look at this holy cow this is this is this is i don't even know what to say this looks like a star wars planet dude or it looks like the lava balls i generate when i'm trolling people in the event videos now this looks like more like the sun in minecraft but this is what we would be seeing down on earth obviously now if, you, if you're lucky enough to ever be an astronaut and go to space you might see something like that but really really far far and far away i couldn't forget one without the other ladies and gents we got the moon the moon in minecraft is a lot different than the sun it's actually really interesting there are textures on the moon there are uh, you can actually see them pretty well too there's different textures to simulate all of the little holes on the moon just like the real moon has now the only downside is just as just like the sun if you try and fly to it you will never ever get any closer because the moon is unattainable in minecraft now what does the moon look like in person well either go outside and look up or let's just google it right now moon oh yeah you know i gotta say man these looking at the sun and the moon is so interesting to me like this is it's so crazy to think that if we just like drive straight up like i don't know four hours or whatever you can go to space you can float you can't breathe and you can go to other planets it's an only a four hour trip it takes longer to fly to london what dude that is so cool hey whoever wants to build a car that could drive straight up i'm down to go on that mission with you so Next up on our list, ladies and gentlemen, we have the good old-fashioned Minecraft chest. These are super essential, let's be honest. Chests are super essential. Now, the only downside to chests is they only look one way. They look just like this, okay? There are no other kinds of chests besides a trap chest and an ender chest that you can obtain in Minecraft. Now, I know in real life, there are plenty of other kinds of chests. You can get small chests, big chests, wide chests, short chests, long chests. I mean, you can get so many different kinds of chests. And some of them are different colors. Maybe a different shade of brown. Maybe a completely different color than brown. I mean, they could be anything chests let's nope nope not not a ripped dude at the gym chest for storing items <laughs> i don't know yeah yeah see this is more like a chest this is a lot more like a minecraft chest okay maybe the brown is a little bit too dark and maybe a little things could be changed around but let's minecraft chest in real life boom here we have it ladies and gents this is a minecraft chest right there if anything ever was closer to a real life chest this is it you have the little iron pull tab right here with the wood decals and all the different shadings required i mean this but and this this looks identical to a minecraft chest kudos to whoever made that that is awesome now for the next one guys i'm not sure if we actually reviewed this one i don't think we did uh because next we up we have sheep and specifically colored wool sheep now i know sheep usually have white wool so i know sheep usually have white wool just like this guy right here now i don't know if they come in pink wool is that is that a thing is it or do they do they dye the wool after they shave the sheep I, I i don't know let's find out pink sheep let's see no no <laughs> dude that's so cool that okay there's no way is that real like that's they're born pink pink sheep real life what oh my god are these pink sheep for real dude what ha huh whoa whoa they look like skittles they literally look like skittles dude all these sheep right here look like a bag of skittles oh my gosh that is actually really adorable that is so cute where can hey hey where can i order a sheep now next up guys we have the jukebox okay we all love a good old jukebox go ahead and grab a music disc maybe if you found that in a mob spawner go ahead pop that in listen to some tunes and have a good time now what does the jukebox look like in real life pretty sure it looks different than this aha i knew it this is a real life jukebox okay they are these are super retro jukeboxes i mean these are probably super old compared to the bluetooth speakers that we have today look this one is literally converted so you can plug your iphone into it but it still has the old iphone jack it has the old audio cable when all the phones now barely have uh, okay never mind wow i mean they look similar but obviously a minecraft jukebox is slightly different than this i have to say though these are so cool imagine just going into an old restaurant and being able to play around with one of these and pick your favorite song like that would be so cool 
This one's a long shot, but phantoms. Phantoms in Minecraft, okay? These things that were re these things that were just recently added a couple versions ago in the game. Okay, personally, they're not my favorite mob. They're actually quite annoying. Now, let's be honest. Unless we're in a really scary movie or a simulated reality, I don't think phantoms are real. But let's see what Google has to say and see if anybody else has come across a phantom. A phantom in real life. Oh my gosh. This is what a phantom would look like in real life. Yeah, that looks almost super close to what a real life phantom would look like. That is that is it, man. Holy. Maybe like this? Yeah, yeah, that's that's honestly this isn't a real life photo. This is a digital art drawing of a phantom, but I have to say this is what they would realistically they would be like giant bats. That's that's exactly what they would be. Giant bats. The last one on our list here, guys, is a little bit prickly, and that is a cactus. In Minecraft, a cactus, the second you touch it, you start taking damage, which honestly is probably what would happen in real life. Instead of you taking damage, you would just be in excruciating pain from all the little pricklies coming out of that cactus. Now, what do they look like in real life, you say? Let's find out. You know, the closest I've ever come to a cactus is a little cactus plant, but oh my gosh, that is literally the cactus plant I'm talking about. That is the closest I've ever come to a real life cactus, but whoa, that is a real life cactus. Holy, that thing is tall. I guarantee that is probably taller than 99.9% .9 of the people watching this video, including myself. That's probably like six, five or something, dude. It looks tall. It looks way taller than me. That's for sure. That is insane. Holy cow, bro. Look at that. Look at that. Do not touch that thing. Do not touch it. It'll prick you. I promise. <laughs> First one you guys are not expecting, okay? This is like not a vanilla item, but I'm telling you it's it's super epic, okay? You ready for this? Three, two, one. <laughs> guys, this is an outdoor speaker in Minecraft. Yes, you can finally listen to your favorite songs outside of your Minecraft house with all your friends. We all know that this can be something from in real life as well. In fact, let's just go check it out. I can't really reach it, but this, this, yeah, that, that's an outdoor oh. speaker, and and this is dog. Wow, like I've never seen it before. Oh my gosh, this is revolutionary. The only difference with the Minecraft version is for some reason you can hit it and it takes damage. Oh, I just killed the outdoor speaker. <laughs> Next up, everybody, this one was a simple one. We got the outdoor chair. Not one, but we got 10 outdoor chairs right here. Everybody needs a chair to sit on, okay? I don't know about you guys, but I am actually pretty sick and tired of making chairs the old-fashioned way in Minecraft with the two signs on the end of it like this. And then shifting and pretending like you're sitting, okay? Well, let's be honest. This could be way cooler. That's why we officially have chairs and you can sit on them. Look how comfortable I am. This is comfiness to the max. Now, of course, once in a while, the outdoor chairs do get uncomfortable, especially if they're wooden ones. So why don't you kick back in a beautiful reclining chair? Look at this, guys. This is what I would like to consider almost a movie theater chair. Right when you're watching a movie or going to the cinema, kick your feet up in one of these. You got your popcorn. Look at the recliner pop out from beneath right when you sit on it. Oh my gosh. Look how many hearts my chair has. For some reason, it has a beating heart inside of it. This is one futuristic chair if I've ever seen one. You have to leave a like on today's video if your chair at home has hearts attached to it like mine does let's go find the reclining chair like this in real life this is an office chair look at this wow oh my goodness wow comfy back support butt support so comfortable oh my gosh ah I had to do it to you guys. This is the first animal that we have on our list in today's video. I'll give you three seconds to take a random guess what this animal could be. Go ahead, okay? Go ahead. Did you guess yet? It's a moose! <laughs> yes, ladies and gentlemen. There is mooses in Minecraft. Wait, mooses? Moose? My mice? No. Moose. Moose. Mooses? Siri, what's plural for moose? Moose. You can officially have a beautiful little moose in Minecraft and you can ride it. Look at this. He loves me now. We're best. We're best friends. Look at how many hearts he has. It's pretty much a four-legged ender dragon at this point. Look how many hearts he has, dude. You can never kill this thing. <laughs> never mess with a moose, ladies and gentlemen. This might be a little bit difficult, but let's go find a moose in real life. I'm gonna just run at George. So this next one's a little awkward because we don't have a pet moose. But I do know somebody. You will not believe what we have just found. Hello? Hello? Oh my god! Oh my god, it's moose! It's a moose! Are you a real moose? Wait, it says moose. Oh, yeah. right. You're moose. Right. Uh, wait, 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 dude! What? Okay. Sorry, man.
All right, guys. So we're taking a step down from mooses here. Moose, sorry, moose. We're taking a step down from a moose here, and we're going back to some more furniture. This, ladies and gentlemen, is a bar stool. In fact, you have all different color bar stools. Look at this. I don't know what happened to this one, but it's... It's going a little bit insane. What is with items having a beating heart? I never thought that I would sit on a bar stool and it would be breathing as I would be. This is just, um, I didn't expect that. These are so cool. I'm actually a huge fan of all the items in today's video because this will just make Minecraft so much cooler. You can make your build so much more detailed. Maybe you wanted to build a little bar area in your building. Or maybe you wanted to build an actual movie theater without having to use staircase and two signs. You can use a real reclining chair. I don't know about you guys, but this is... This is really, this is such a cool feature. Leave a like right now if you think Minecraft should add all these things to their game. I don't know about you, but personally, this would make the game so much better. If any Minecraft executives are watching today's video, please just email me. Um, we, you know, I, I, I got a bunch of ideas. I have one question for all of you guys, especially for all my meme gurus here. What is the number one place to get knowledge from? Okay, you need to know this answer. You need to know this answer. You need to know this answer. A bookshelf. Guys, knowledge, Lamborghini, bookshelves. You can officially have bookshelves in Minecraft. Look at this. They look so cool. Wait, can you put books inside of them? Please allow me to put books in it. Please, please, please. Oh, what the flip? That would have been so cool, dude. Wait, what if I throw it? Nope, that doesn't work. Okay, the bookshelf in this mod is clearly not the most, it's not the most friendly bookshelf because you can't put books in it. So it's mainly just decoration. And well, if you can't put books in a bookshelf, then it's a shelf with no books and it's not a book. This and this is a bookshelf with a row of books. Knowledge. Okay, I'm confusing myself. Bookshelves! Beside your bookshelves, of course, you guys need a lamp, a little desk lamp. Look at these and look at these little things. And they actually emit light as well. So if I go ahead and I change it to nighttime, time set night. Whoop, okay, they emit just a little bit of light. <laughs> it's not that bright, but they do. It's so cool, dude. It's like the lights I got on my desk here, but these aren't it's supposed to be lamps. These are recording lights. Oh, you know what I mean? Now you have a little desk lamp and you also have a big standing desk lamp that you can have beside your bed in Minecraft. I think that's super awesome. Super. It's super amazing, finally. I'm starting to turn this world into an Ikea, bro. <laughs> We're not all the way to Ikea just yet until we have some fans, guys, and they work as well. I don't know about you, but in the summertime, it gets hot, and especially I'm in Texas right now, so boy, is Texas always hot. You need to make sure you have your fans going almost all the time or else, or else you're going to be sweating 24-7. You can officially have a working fan in Minecraft, and the coolest part is there's no cable for it. You don't have to plug it in. It doesn't require any resources, and it just automatically starts spinning. You have two different kinds of fans. You have the, you have the jumbo stand-up fans just like this, and you also have the small ones that you can put on a desk. Why can't I spawn a small fan? I am just killing jumbo fans. This is so gruesome. Why are they all dying? We have a small fan for our desk right here. Now this is epic. 10 out of 10. I love this. <laughs> this is a fan, but it's not spinning. But here, listen. It, it, it's not a spinny fan like in Minecraft, but it's a fan. Okay, and it, it does what fans do. And eh, it, it's blowing air. See, you can, you can hear it. Listen, please purposely make that very loud and annoying. <laughs> we got a fan in real life. Yay. Well, no house is complete without, of course, a coffee table. Now you can officially put your coffee table and for some reason you can sit on it. I wouldn't necessarily want to sit on the coffee table because you're supposed to put like coffee and drinks of food on it, but you can certainly put a bunch of chairs around it and hang out with all your friends, dude. Look how cool this is. Me and the boys chilling at the coffee table. <laughs> even the coffee table has hearts. How is that even possible? Look at this. It's a table with nothing on it. Okay, I kind of like not having anything on it. All we need is chair, 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 and then we are set. We're set. Table in real life versus Minecraft. This is a skeleton in Minecraft, and this is a skeleton in real life. <laughs> oh my gosh, yeah, that's definitely a skeleton in real life. He's just chilling. Skeleton with bow in real life. Is there one? Oh my gosh. It's a real life Minecraft skeleton. What the heck? Oh my gosh, guys. Oh, uh, oh, uh, uh. oh, I gotta save that for later. Nope, nope, nope. I can't, I can't look at that. I can't look at that. Oh my gosh. This is a regular Minecraft zombie. And this is what a real life zombie would look like. Oh my gosh, dude. That is so creepy. What the heck? Ah, zombies. This is a drowned in Minecraft. 
I don't know why they're even in the game, but they're here. Have we not found any real life pictures of a drowned yet? What the heck? There's no way. I don't believe it. This honestly, I think is a Minecraft video. This literally looks like a drowned in real life, dude. Like that, no, that is creepy. This is a villager in Minecraft. Oh gosh, we, we got a lot of villagers, am I right? <laughs> and this is a villager in real life. <laughs> Holy cow, dude. Look at this. Look at the nose on that thing. That is massive. Oh, no. That's a real Minecraft villager now. Oh, nope. That's a real Minecraft villager. <laughs> These are Minecraft parrots. Or, well, what parrots would be portrayed to look like in Minecraft. And this would be parrots in real life. They actually look so freaking cute, dude. I love parrots. Okay, I love parrots so much. I think it'd be so cool to get one. Hey, let me know if you guys like parrots down below in the comments. They are so cool, man. They can literally talk to you. Oh, gosh. I don't know if I'm ready for this next one, honestly. Okay, let's let's just <laughs> prep yourselves. Prep yourselves, okay? This is a ghast in Minecraft. And quite honestly, they aren't bad, okay? I could handle it. But real life modified? <laughs> I don't know about that. And this is apparently a ghast in real life. Ugh. Oh, that's creepy. Wow. Yeah, that that's creepy. That is that. Yeah. Oh, wow. Yep. Oh, same one. Eek, eh. Oh, oh, what the? That's a ghast? Uh, dude, what? Oh, it's, a, <laughs> it's an airplane with a ghast on it. <laughs> that's amazing. I don't know how I feel about the ghast, dude. That's a little weird for me. This is a slime in Minecraft. And this is a slime in real life. Dude, look how cute he is. Oh, he's so squishy. But beware, he might just hop and try to eat you. That's so cute. Oh my gosh. I actually love that. That is just, that is terrifying. That is, this is me when I wake up in the morning and there's no food downstairs. Yeah, that, that is, that, that is me. This is a blaze in Minecraft. These darn things always shooting fireballs at us, man, dude. Ah, oh, it's just, I, it's just, they're always anno annoying. Let's be honest. And this is apparently what a blaze would look like in Minecraft. Or wait, wait, no. This is what a blaze would look like in real life. Thank goodness that that is not real. A floating head with floating gems all around it like that. Nah, nah, -uh. no, thank you. Oh gosh. This one's going to be terrible. This one this next one's going to bring back all my very terrifying young teenage Slenderman days. <laughs> These are Endermen in Minecraft. And this is what an Enderman would look like in real life. Just more terrifying. Like, literally terrifying. Oh my gosh. Wow, that is, that is scary. He's in a cave or something. Hey, put that creeper down, man. Come on, dude. That's not nice. Put him down. Pick on somebody your own side. And don't even worry. We couldn't have forgotten of pigmen. Okay, pigmen are such a very big part. And they're all running away from me. They're, they're running. Pigmen are the core mob that you fight the second you enter the nether in Minecraft. So what would they look like in real life exactly? Oh, gosh. That's what a pigmen would look like? I mean, how should I be surprised? He's ripped. He's got a massive golden enchanted sword and... He's half eaten. It, it, it looks like a pigman. Oh, wow. That is terrifying. Don't ever mess with a pigman in real life, ladies and gents. Do not do it. Oh, that is scary. That is, oh, oh my goodness. Where'd his arm go? His hand. Oh, no. What the heck? Oh, that's, that's a legit just a pig. <laughs> okay, and of course, wolves, right? In Minecraft, they just look like cute little things that just want to become your best friend, almost like a puppy when you bring them home for the first day. Wolves are so adorable in Minecraft, but are they so adorable in real life? This is what a wolf would probably look like in the wild. Does he look so cute and cuddly now? Didn't think so. Oh, wow. This, this is me. When I wake up and my pizza rolls aren't done, and then this is me when my chicken nuggets are done out of the oven and I'm playing Minecraft. Look at how cute I am. This is me with the boys. <laughs> wow, I never realized how cute and how terrifying a wolf could look in literally two different pictures. Okay, yeah, that's that's enough. That's enough for me there. Oh my gosh. And of course, how could we even forget? Just like wolves, we have little kittens. They're so cute, all different sizes, all different color kittens. They're so adorable. Look at them. Oh my goodness. Now, how could you not fall in love with a cat in Minecraft? They're even <laughs> What the heck? No, no, thank you. Oh, yeah. This is... If I were a cat, this would be me right there. They're so cute. How could you not love a little kitten? Oh, my goodness. It looks like Simon. Oh, my goodness. 
Simon, I love you, dude. Oh my goodness, dude. The cat, neon cat. Oh my gosh, bro, it's so adorable, man. All right, guys, so I am back in my Minecraft world here today. And well, holy cow, you guys have been absolutely loving this series that we have going on right now. I'd like to say this is like a little mini series. It's something on the side that we can do that's really cool. We get to see what we see in the video game compared to real life. All right, guys, so the first one on our list here is a Minecraft cave. I will bet you guys that you have gone inside of a Minecraft cave more times than you can even think of. I mean, caves are just so natural in Minecraft, but you know, would you just go hopping into a cave in real life if you saw one? I mean, I would, but I, I don't know if I would go super far down to bedrock, but all right, let's see what a real life cave looks like. Yo, okay, that looks cool. Obviously, this isn't like a one-to-one -to, -one to a Minecraft cave or anything like that, but if you were to find some caves in real life, chances are they might look something similar to this. Maybe not as beautiful though, probably more terrifying. Cave that looks like minecraft is that a thing <laughs> yep me and the boys down in the cave <laughs> oh this would definitely be more of a minecraft cave very narrow very small yes this is more of what we're looking at here i'm gonna say minecraft did a really good job at showcasing what a cave is compared to real life this one is shark approved you know the famous saying right sun's out guns out no 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 hey no we're not bringing the muscles out today, okay? Because when the sun comes out, you want to know what comes out? The bumblebees. They are everywhere. They're good. They're looking for some honey. They are making a bunch of hives. You know, I got to say, I do like honey, though. It's really good. Thank you, bumblebees, for everything that you guys do. Now, the funny thing with a bee in Minecraft is that they are probably like a quarter of the size of a pig. Like, the bee is the size of the pig's head. And I know in real life, bees are nowhere near that size unless you found some super rare legendary bee that is probably going to take over the world. Yeah, usually they're not that big because that's a pretty considerably big bee. Yep, now this is more like it. Look at that. Okay, now that is a regular size bee on top of a flower. Now that flower is pretty small. Same goes for this one. Look at that, okay? There is no way that this bee could go and fly beside a pig and be anywhere near its size. I mean, the pig would crush it. The pig breathes in more food than the bee eats in a year. Like I'm telling, it's uh, okay. Oh yeah, yeah, I think you get the point. Next up in Minecraft is one of everybody's favorites. We, we all love leaving the overworld and going and traveling through new dimensions such as the nether or even the end. Now, if I can make my portal here and light it up just like that, this is how Minecraft, now this is how Minecraft perceives a real life portal to look like. Now, what exactly would a portal look like in real life? Let's find out. Whoa, okay, yeah. Obviously, this is a video game portal. This is not real life. It literally says World of Warcraft right there. But if a portal were in real life, let, okay, let's see. Nether portal in real life. Let's see. Oh my goodness. What? Uh, <laughs> yes. Now that is more like a nether portal, if you ask me. Holy, oh my gosh, look at that. You're just walking through the park one day, walking your dog with your little drink, and you look to the left, and you're like, oh, there's a portal right there. What the heck? Yeah, you know, if I saw a nether portal in real life, I would probably go inside of it. I would be very curious to know exactly what's on the other side. Leave a like if you would go inside the nether portal as well. All right, so this is a watermelon in Minecraft. Now, it's actually kind of funny. Watermelons in Minecraft are these cubes. I mean, then again, every other block in Minecraft is a cube, as you can see. But watermelons in real life aren't actually cubes. And I think we all know this. Watermelon. Let's just see. All right. Call me out if I'm wrong on this or something, but I have never, ever in my life seen a cubed watermelon. Every watermelon I've ever seen looks like these. These are regular watermelons. They're delicious. They're watery. Maybe you got a little bit of seed in there. They're good, but they're not cubes. What the? No. Cubed watermelon. Let's see. Uh. Uh. No. 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 No, this, this can't be. My life has been a lie this whole time. Oh my God. No way. I, I, I can't. I, I really can't. I, I'm, my mind is, is, if that's real, mind is completely blown. Okay. Maybe watermelon's an exception. Okay. But what about a pumpkin? I don't believe I have ever seen a cubed pumpkin, okay? Every time October comes around, one of my favorite, one of my favorite seasons throughout the year because Halloween and pumpkins and cold weather and uh, scary movies. I have never ever gone to the pumpkin patch and got myself a cubed pumpkin, okay? You, you, you're probably crazy if you do. 
Then again, what would it look like in real life? Is this something that's legit? Pumpkin, let's just see. See, they're all round. All pumpkins are round. Look at them. These are what normal pumpkins look like. Now, I know for a fact, if I searched up, if I search up cubed pumpkin, there's probably gonna be a cubed pumpkin. This is going to be a cursed image. Cubed pumpkin. Oh my gosh. Okay, well, the, that's literally pumpkin cubes. I, I meant like the whole pumpkin. <laughs> They took the guts out of the pumpkin and cut it up into cubes. No, I, I literally, no, no, that's not what, I, oh my, okay, never mind, never mind. Let's just forget about that. All right, so next up, we have a beautiful, cute little panda. I don't think we've actually showcased the pandas before. I just got to say how much I love pandas. If I were an animal, I would be a panda. Okay, look, what is the key to my heart, you may ask? Food. Look at this man. Look at this panda now. He is so happy because he just got his breakfast, okay? This is the key to my heart. This is the key to a panda's heart. I would be a panda. Now, are pandas as cute in real life as they are in Minecraft? Oh my gosh, yes, yes, yes. Take my money now. Take it. I need one. They are just as cute in real life, maybe even cuter in real life than they are in Minecraft. Oh my, hi. Look, he's saying hi. That's so cute. Oh my goodness. And look, he's eating his breakfast. The bamboo. Oh, I love pandas so much dude this video is called i want to see bedrock in real life this has to be a gem of some sort hey guys ryan here and i feel like breaking something good start to the video hey guys it's shark here and i feel like putting a hole in my wall oh he's super sand running where are you going where are you going yes. Oh, what the heck? That was a zombie in Minecraft. Oh, no, no, no. Hold up, hold up, hold up. No, that scared me. I thought that was Minecraft zombie in his game. What the heck? Get out of here. <laughs> I mean, I uh, got to get back to mining uh, bedrock, of course. <clears throat> He's digging. Where's the bedrock in real life? I really, that's what I clicked on for this video. Maybe that's why it's got that many dislikes. Hey, he broke it. He broke the shovel. No. Okay. You know what? This was definitely me when I was 11 years old. So I'm going to help him out. Okay. We're going to, we're going to, we're going to help him out. Okay. I'm, I'm going to leave a like on this video. All right. The kid's just having some fun outside, but this is not breaking bedrock. I want to see some real bedrock. Dude, everything when you search bedrock in real life is literally Minecraft. Oh, what's this? Bedrock in gold deposit. This was posted five years ago. Now, the bedrock outcropping, you don't often find, well, you don't always find them in creeks, but if you do find a bedrock outcrop of some sort that is totally the place to check out i'm glad to know that if i ever go mining and if i see bedrock i should look nearby because there's probably diamonds or gold you may have learned that one from minecraft but it's certainly valuable information if you remember gold settles down through the gravels down until it finds something it can't settle through now right here this bedrock is solid it may have cracks and stuff in it but it doesn't have anywhere for the gold to continue its downwards travel. You'll see. I thought for a second all of these. I thought for a second all of these leaves were gold, like like golden coins from like the pirates or something. But now I'm just realizing it's all just it's all just yeah, leaves. I think. Side, I think. There's a good chance it's close to the surface. So did he go down to the what I would say is look we're basically underneath your butt there. See if there's any cracks that are full of dirt and try those. If not that, I really hope you enjoyed today's video. If you want to watch some more from me, you, you see the end card that is right there. All you got to do is click that <laughs> oh or the playlist. Gosh, you can dude, watch a bunch more videos flip. from this me. This is Go way ahead. too cool. This is Lego Bedrock in real life, ladies and gents. This guy right here made his very own Bedrock, but in real life, and it's made out of Legos. Dude, that looks so cool. Well, um, it's basically unbreakable unless you're in creative mode with a blast resistance of 18 million. Uh, so that's pretty crazy. It's got that sort of dark particle effect that was built um, with a lot of little black studs uh, one by one. This is probably the closest we'll get to a lookalike bedrock block that we know from Minecraft. Because all the other real bedrock is like an actual rock and it kind of doesn't really look like that. But it, you, you know what I mean. Dude, this is so cool. Oh my gosh. I, I kind of want to get a Lego bedrock now. <laughs> that's so awesome. If this video does break 20,000 likes, I will get a wall of bedrock. How cool would that be? I wonder if my player has finished mining bedrock yet. Let's go check. Yo, you won't believe it. Look, guys, I got bedrock. 